Hey, Mom and Dad. Um, <clears throat> hello, honey. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> What's for dinner? Whatever the chefs bring out. Oh, okay, cool. Now, honey, I told you we need to find a prince for her. A prince? Really, Mom? I'm fine. I don't need a prince. Now, honey, you're coming to that age that you might need to think about marrying a prince. You guys are being ridiculous. I'm fine without a prince. Well, who's going to help you run the kingdom? And you need some help. And you, you, you don't want to be known with princeless. Ugh. But all the princes are rich snobby boys and i don't i don't like that you know i want to find true love oh honey there's no such thing as true love now honey you don't say that to me um i didn't mean you obviously i mean me and you have true love but uh for our daughter you know since she is to marry a prince you know there's likely it's not gonna be true love like us that's exactly why i don't want to marry a prince i'm going to my room what about just let her go, honey. She needs time to think. I can't believe they want me to get married to some random prince guy that's gonna just be so spoiled and not help me with anything. At least I'm in my room now. I'm kind of hungry, though. Maid! Hey, my cheese! What can I get for you? Grace. I am hungry. I need you to go get me some food. Oh, what kind of food do you want? I can get you pancakes, uh, bacon. I can get you any kind of food. I can get you chicken, um, pizza roast. Um, I guess I want some popcorn. Popcorn? I can get you popcorn. Do you want butter? Do you want no butter? Do you want extra butter? Do you want regular butter? Extra butter is fine. Do you want anything to drink with that? I can get you a Coke. I can get you soda. I can get you anything. I can get you lemonade. I can get you pink lemonade. I can get you a loaded tea. I can just get you water. If you want a water, that's fine. I like Mountain Dew, too, if you want. Like, yeah. Uh, no drink. Just extra butter popcorn. Okay, I'll be right with the popcorn. Hey, bye! Okay, extra popcorn. Here you go. Extra butter. You know, no drink, no nothing. It's just, just like how you asked and stuff. And it's even in a cute little container like, you know, they have at the movie theaters. And I hope you like it. I have plenty of popcorn. Hey, bye! Thanks, I guess. Okay. I can't believe my parents want me to marry some random guy. This is so good. Mm. The next day. Your Majesty. <laughs> welcome, Sir Francis. Yes, welcome to the castle. We will show you to your room. Thank you, Your Majesty. Oh, here comes our daughter now. Hey, Mom and Dad, why do you want me to come in here? Whoa, she's as beautiful as a daisy in it. Uh, 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 I don't even know. Uh, Mom, Dad, who is this? This is Prince Francis. Hello, you beautiful royal. <laughs> Which is this? Hello, uh, Prince Francis. Thanks a lot for coming, but I'm not interested. Now, Polly, you will marry this dude. I, I mean, uh, you're you're gonna spend three days with this dude, and you're gonna see if you love this boy or not. Three whole days, Mom, with this weirdo? No way. Princess Paula, please give me a chance. Fine, but there's no way you're going to win my heart in three days. I'm going to my room. What are we going to do with that girl? My deepest apologies, Prince Francis. Um, we will get our best maid to show you where your room is. Hey, Prince Francis, nice to meet you. I'm going to show you to your room. I love talking, so I hope you... I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about our kingdom and our princess. <laughs> Come on, follow me. <laughs> Or nor. Oh, I can't believe mom and dad would do that. I, I thought they were, like, you know, I thought didn't think they were actually going to get a prince to come all this way just to spend three days with me to see if I like him. But there's no way I'm ever going to like him or anyone because, you know, everyone that I can marry, they're just spoiled brats. Oh, I just can't believe them. Whatever. I don't care. Um, I'm just going to hang out in my room all day, so that way Prince Francis can't even come and, you know, see me, huh? I need a way she'll like me, so I'll take her on a ride tomorrow, <laughs> you know? Maybe a few kisses on the way. That day, the princess stayed in her room the whole day so Francis couldn't talk to her, but the next day she was forced to go on a date with him. 
I can't believe Francis really thinks he has a chance. But he told me to meet him here anyway, so I guess I'm going on a horse riding date with him. Here's my horse. I'll be surprised if he even shows up in overalls for this. Well, anyway, I guess I'll feed my horse. I've never really done this before. Since I'm a princess, I don't really have to. Here you go, pony. What's her name again? Oh, yeah, Eliza. Wow, I should really go ride my horse more. Oh, I think I see him coming. Okay, here I go to ride horses. <gasps> your majesty. Oh, hey, you're still wearing your crown? Uh, I never take it off. I just don't know if it's the best for horse riding, but okay. Here's my beautiful stallion. Um, cool. So, should we go riding now? Yes, your majesty. Okay. Okay, we're here, so... Okay, your majesty. Let me show you my cool horseback riding tricks. Okay. Watch this! Ah! I got a boo-boo! Are you okay? <laughs> Princess, I have a boo-boo. Um, sorry? What do you want me to do? <sighs> I don't know. Maybe marry me? Uh, nope. Princess, wait. Our date isn't over. Uh, fine, what else do you have? Follow me and your beautiful stallion will come too. Um, okay. This right here is the highest horse jump in the land. Um, yeah, I see that. It is a really high horse jump. I will be jumping it for my for your love. You couldn't even jump past that other one. How are you going to do this one? I will use the power of our love. Uh, yeah. Well, good luck with that. Watch, your majesty. Here I go. No. Ah, no, it knocked down. Yeah, that's it. I think I'm gonna go home. It's late. Please, your majesty, one more thing. Fine. Are you kidding me? This is the only place to eat around here? Oh, it's a nice cute little food truck. Wait, you like this? It's so cute. Uh, of course, I like this too. Here you go, eat this. Hey, you have to pay for that. Be quiet. Okay. Let me try this. This is so good. Really? Are you in love with me now? Uh, I gotta go. No, princess. The next day. Nails! We're very sorry, prince. But our daughter doesn't seem to like you, so we're gonna have to, you know, send you out the castle. No, please, I can win the princess's heart over. Just give me more time. Sorry, son, our princess doesn't seem to like you. Yeah, I don't really like you. And that date, that was not a good date. D don't you like horse riding, though? I do, but it just wasn't fun. <laughs> Fine, I, I didn't need you anyway. Beautiful princess, I I'm leaving now. <laughs> uh, does he know he just went into the closet? Oh, wrong door. <laughs> Bye. Honey, you have to find somebody. Luckily, that was the only of the first prints. The next one will be coming any second now. Another one, Mom and Dad? You have to get married at some point. So, well, we're inviting all the princes. I don't like any of them. Honey? <sighs> Whatever, Dad. Well, the prince told me that you're going to meet him on your date, so I think that's downstairs in the kitchen. In the kitchen? Ugh, okay. Okay, I'm in the kitchen. Where is my date? Oh, hello, your highness. Um, I'm gonna be your date. Oh, uh, the spaghetti's, it's burning. Uh, uh, sorry about that. Oh, um, it's fine. Well, um, let me try it. Maybe it's good. Oh, it's not good. Maybe we can bake something else. Uh, um, okay. Here's some chips that we can eat. <laughs> um, thanks. These are good. Yeah, <laughs> uh, num num num. Just a quick question. If you don't know how to cook, then why did you take me on a cooking date? I took you on a cooking date because I thought maybe, you know, you would be impressed by my cooking skills. And plus, I can cook some of the time, just not all of the time.
Oh, uh, listen, I know this was our first date, but I have another one planned tomorrow. Okay. Okay, so, um, yeah, just meet me, um, in one of the living rooms. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, he's interesting. He seems really nervous, though. Oh, gosh, I definitely messed that up. Oh, sorry, your highness, uh, sorry, I didn't see you there, and, oh, oh, you're wearing a chef hat. I don't know if you remember you're wearing a chef hat. Here, I'll take that to the kitchen for you if you want me to. Oh, uh, hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, your highness, uh, so do you want me to take this chef hat back to the kitchen? Because you're right, the kitchen's right there, and I'm on the way there, so yeah, yeah, I can take it back to the kitchen if you want me to. Whoa, slow down, I can't understand what you're saying. Sorry, I go a little fast when I'm talking. I can tell. I said, do you want me to take this hat back to the kitchen? That would be nice, actually. Thanks. No problem. <laughs> wow, that prince was cute! Oh, your majesty, um, I definitely did not call the prince cute. <laughs> I don't care, I'm not interested anyway. <laughs> well then. <laughs> the next day. Oh, uh, hello, princess. Hey, are you ready to go hiking? Yeah, I think I am. Um, that's good. Uh, your majesty's hi. I bought you both lunches, you know, especially you. Um, yeah, so here, here's your lunches for you guys to go hiking on your hiking date. Just the two of you and not me coming. Anyway, um, have a nice time. <laughs> oh, uh, bye. What's your name, by the way? Oh, um, my name, uh... <laughs> She didn't tell me her name. That's weird. But at least she made us lunches. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, let's go. Why didn't she tell me her name? <sighs> well, here we are. Yeah, on this hike trail. I'm definitely good at hiking. Well, I'd hope so. Yeah, of course. <sighs> okay. Oh, be careful in this log. I will. Oh, good job. Ah! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. It doesn't hurt at all. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Uh, let, let's continue. Uh, okay. Come on. I'm coming. Oh my goodness, this is a long hike. I need a break. But we just started three minutes ago. Only three? That's farther than I thought I would even make it. Okay. I might just hike the rest of this myself. Wait, princess. Listen, I can tell you're not the best hiker. I think you should just save yourself now. Plus, you hurt your leg pretty bad out back there. Oh, you're right. I'll see you back at the castle, buddy. <sighs> okay. I knew he wasn't going to last that long. Whatever. This is a nice hiking trail. Wait, what's going on over there? Okay, little animals. Did you enjoy my fairy tale story? No. Rabbit, rabbit. I'm glad. Now, how about some food for all of you? Nom, nom, nom. That was the last of my food, but it's worth it for you guys. Rabbit, rabbit. He's so caring and handsome. Is this true love? I'm starving. <gasps> Is that somebody over there? Huh? Uh, wait! Oh, I hope he didn't see me. Wait a second. Huh? Are you the princess? Um, uh, no. What makes you think that? I'm obviously not the princess. I just saw your tiara. Yeah, fine. I'm the princess. Why didn't you want me to know that you were the princess? Because people start treating me differently once they find out. Well, I don't care who you are. You seem like a nice person. Uh, yeah, I'd say so. It was nice to meet you, by the way. Yeah, oh wait, I think I have something for you. Here you go. Oh wow, is this food? Yeah, I heard you gave the last food to those animals over there. Yeah, that was very caring of you. Uh, thanks, um... Oh, this looks delicious. Hmm. Yeah, uh, well, I better get going now. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll see you later. Yeah. Wow, he was so handsome. 
and amazing. Wait, what am I thinking? He's a commoner, and Mom and Dad would never let me marry a commoner, because they only want me to marry a prince. I thought I finally found my true love. I'm going to go home. <sighs> my true love. Can't, I can't even marry my true love. I'm just going to go to sleep. The next day. Sorry, ma'am, but it doesn't look like you're the one for our daughter. You're really nice, but just not my true love. Yeah, I got it. Hey, um, since you and the princess are not, like, working out or anything, I thought maybe you could, like, get my phone number where you could call and just blah, 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 yeah, that. Wait, what? Um, can I have your number? You want my number? Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, there it is. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye. Does he know that he also went in the closet? Uh, uh, wrong door. <laughs> Why does that keep happening? Well, thank goodness that's finally over, right, Mom? Now I can go back to just doing whatever I want. Not so fast, honey. We're still looking for a prince for you. Mom, for the last time, I don't need one. Nonsense. Your prince will be here tomorrow. We'll meet him in the morning. So, for now, just enjoy the day without a prince. Ah. Uh. The next day... You are just perfect for our daughter. Exactly what we're looking for. All right then, well, I guess I should just take her hand in marriage. Of course you should. Is that an even option? Eh, she'll love you anyway, I think. Oh, here she comes now. Hey mom, hey dad. Oh, another prince. I'll just probably dismiss you like the rest of them. Well, honey, actually we've decided we want you to marry him. What? Dad, no way. I want to find my true love. Well, it's taking you too long to find your true love, so we chose one for you. I... Uh, uh, I'm so done with this, Mom and Dad. I should choose who I want to be with. Well, who do you want to be with then? I'll tell you who I want to be with. There's this boy in the, in the woods. He lives there, and he's just perfect. He's so nice to everyone and animals, and he's just the sweetest person ever, and he's so handsome. <gasps> I didn't mean to say that. <gasps> Where's that servant of ours? Yes? Are you talking about me? Huh? Hope you're talking about me. What are you going to do? I don't, I don't know what you want me to do. Um, so this is kind of awkward. Y'all look shocked, but I don't really know what happened. So what happened? Go find the boy that lives in the forest and bring him here. Of course, Your Majesty. What are you going to do to him, Dad? I'm going to put him in prison forever. He didn't do anything, though. Well, I don't care. You're never seeing that guy again. And you're going to marry this new prince right here. I don't even know his name. Why would he be my true love? Uh, because, um, I'm, like, perfect and I'm the rich, handsome prince that every girl wants. Uh, I don't want you. Um, almost every girl, I mean. Ugh, this is so unfair, Dad. Oh, this is so boring. I'm just gonna... I can't wait any longer. Wait? For what? Listen, show me to where all your money is. <gasps> what? Yeah, I just use this as an excuse to get in your castle. Now show me where all the money is. And why would we do that? Because I have this. Dirty clothes? What? Wrong thing. Sorry. The enchanted pearl. <gasps> it's floating. What is it, Dad? It's an enchanted pearl that can summon anyone and trap anyone inside its clam. <gasps> oh, no. So, we can do this the easy way or the hard way. Sir, I got the boy. What? What's going on? Where am I? <gasps> it's you. It's you. Ugh. I'm going to take that as a guess. It's the easy way then. So show me where the money is. <gasps> Are you being robbed right now? Yes. Yeah. Bah. I know about this thing. My animals told me about it. Your animals can talk. Not right now. <gasps> <gasps> did I do it? What? Uh, you did it. You saved us. The whole, the whole country. Oh my goodness. You saved us. Yay, he saved us, which is crazy, because, you know, you never thought, like, a commoner would save anybody, and, like, because, you know, they never really, like, yeah. <laughs> Why are you crying? My dad doesn't want me to marry you, and he's gonna, he's gonna put you in the dungeon. <gasps> what, the dungeon? Oh, no, 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 I'm not going in the dungeon. I should have never underestate, uh, underestimated you, honey. Huh? Uh, honey, what's going on? Uh, I, I don't even know what's happening. I know I said that 
you know, I would pick out who you love and true love doesn't exist. I am, except for me and your mother. But, um, yeah, I've been proven wrong. Like, you two really do love each other and I shouldn't have, you know, judged him because he was a poor peasant and you are a princess. Because I think anybody can belong together. And y'all clearly love each other. Oh my goodness, does this mean that we can, like, date and stuff? Of course it does. I am so happy for you guys. This calls for a celebration. Woohoo! Um, so actually I have an important question for you. Oh yeah, what is it? I love important questions, especially coming from you. You know, I love you. I mean, no, I didn't say that. I didn't say anything actually. Um, anyway, yeah, what's your important question? Will you marry me? Here's the rings. Oh my word, you want to marry me? I mean, I know we just met and all, but... Yes, yes, of course I do. Yes, um, yes. I've never been so happy in my life. Me either. <laughs> I can't believe you asked me to marry you because you're a prince and I'm, I'm just like a worker, but now I'm a princess because technically if we're getting married, then I'd be a lady, then I'd be a princess. Yeah. Oh, congratulations. <gasps> Thank you. Well, this is awkward. I don't really have anybody to hang out with. You can hang out with me. Uh, what are you? Uh, sorry. Bye. I can't believe this. We're going to be so happy. And we're going to have like t 12 dogs and 16 cats. And basically the whole palace is going to be full of animals. Yes. I can't believe our daughter is finally happy. I knew all she needed was true love. I should have saw that a long time ago. It's okay. Remember how you found me? Yeah, it was so romantic. Mwah. Woo. Thank you so much for watching this story, guys. I'll see you next week, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please like, subscribe, and go watch some more of my videos, because if you like this one, You'll like my other ones. So, yeah. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Jesus loves you. Bye.